matchup early in the season, and uh, we're going to get their best shot, and we got to bring on. Friday night football, you like that? Yeah, it's going to be pretty cool. Um, I haven't played on Friday night since uh, you know, I was in high school, and um, it should be a good atmosphere here. we got Grange Grove going, and I'm, I'm excited to put on a good show. So what's Bill like during practice? <laughs> Yeah, I think the way we did it uh, with team at least yesterday was, or Saturday was, you know, we were kind of all together anyway, so he could just pop back and forth. But um, I don't think he's going to have too much to do with the defense just because, you know, Coach Banks and Coach Fair do a good job. Um, and, you know, he's so all focused. Um, but I'm sure he'll take over some, at least more, just walking around in ma managerial roles, maybe not so much scheme or anything like that. There's no cloud. We don't yeah. feel cloudy at all. Um, we feel like there's a little bit of an added buzz to the whole mm -hmm. thing, you know, with Friday night and and uh, you know, with everything that's happened. It's been crazy, but you know. We've seen a lot of stuff here over our career, especially as the seniors, and, you know, we're ready to go. And I think, you know, camps is buzzing a little bit, and um, we're excited. What have you seen as a student, kind of from your friends and from other kids in your classes, just as the talk of the campus? Well, everyone asks, you know, what's going on and how's the team feeling. I, you get probably the same question like 20 times, I, you know, um, just walking around, but, you know, they just want to know. And I don't think anyone um, is distraught. Obviously, there's going to be naysayers, and, People may think, you know, it's kind of uh, circusy at times, but you know, we don't feel like that in our in, in the building. And um, you know, what we talked about as a team was just to remain calm. You know, people are going to take shots at you just because that's the nature of what happened here this past week. Um, people on campus. Yeah, people on campus. Just people around you know, and on Twitter and stuff. And you, you stay know. off social media. No, I mean I don't tweet that much. You guys see that um but I, I i go i get my news from there and just, you know I've, I've seen some reactions on twitter and stuff and uh you know um it's an unfortunate situation but we're keeping it as positive as we can and you know we're ready to roll right now so anybody on the coaching staff talk to any of you guys about you know their availability you know if, if you're concerned about something you know make sure you're talking to us if you're hurt make sure you're letting us know is anything any change there at all yeah there's been a lot of change especially just in i think the um just avenues to re of reporting. I think it's been an emphasis in the whole athletic department in general. Um, we've had a few meetings, I mean, as all athletes as well, if, like this is what you, there's like several avenues to report if you're feeling mistreated. Um, yeah. And is that significantly different than, than no, a year no, ago? No, no. no. I mean, it's just, I guess, more of an emphasis because it's just because it was blasted out to the public. Um, but I don't, I don't think, I mean, we've had meetings like that before, of like yeah. Where, yeah. where to go if you feel you know, just different uh, resources for you. Does that change anything for you? For me? Yeah. No. no I don't. I've never felt mistreated. Um, I've never felt abused. I've, I've always, I mean, I felt like I want to play football here. And, you know, I love playing football here. Um, I've never had a problem with any of my coaches, and that's, you know, probably pretty rare considering I've had about 12. <laughs> um, but, you know, uh, you know, it's been a good experience here for me, and especially with the doctors, you know, I'm, with my injury, I never felt one-time pressure, um, and I've had, I've had just a first-class experience, to be honest. How yeah, eager are you to actually just be able to play a game? Yeah, it's been a lot. I feel like since the start of camp until now, it feels about three months. It's only been a month. Um, yeah, I'm ready to go on Friday. I'm glad it's a quick week, too. I'm glad we get to play on Friday and then enjoy some, some matchups on Saturday. Do you look at it as like kind of an opportunity? Like you talked about some naysayers or people taking shots. Is it this first game kind of an opportunity to show people what you guys are made of and yourselves that you know this team's able to move forward and Absolutely. have some resolve? I mean, everyone's. Yeah. We're going to have naysayers here regardless if, you know, Coach Beck was still here or not. And we've looked at this game as a, just a kind of, you know, we want to make a little statement um, to our fans, to the community, and to the university that, you know, we want to we want to be a successful program here. And this is the first step. You know, you get 12. Um, you get 12 to earn a 13th and 14th, so this is number one. Have you talked to, to Beckman at all since Friday? I texted him. Yeah. Um, I haven't gotten a chance to, you know, call him or anything. What did you say to him? I just said, you know. Love you, coach, and you know, sorry that all this happened. Uh, you know, I, I feel for him. I mean, it's a it's a tough situation, especially for him and his family, and you know, everyone involved.
He get back to you? Yeah, he is. Yeah. Oh. Do you guys kind of have to calm yourselves down before Friday night when you get out there? Really no, I think we got a, we got a good little buzz buzz creating, and I think it'll it'll amp up. And you got to get more. Uh, you got to prepare a little bit earlier now, you know, with a short week. But um, you know, I can speak for at least the O line. We try not to get too too wild until you know it was Thursday night. But Wednesday night now, and then you know you go in, you relax on Thursday, and then get it going on Friday. Are you gonna be able to pay attention to class on Friday? Oh yeah, I'm on all online classes, so you know, I'm, <laughs> I'm living right now.